It's time to set the record straight on Israel's border with Gaza. Hamas seized power in Gaza in 2007 and has controlled it since. Rather than investing in infrastructure to support their own civilians, Hamas has been investing millions and millions of dollars in terrorist infrastructure to kill Israeli civilians. That was Hamas's choice. Israel maintained two crossings into Gaza, Erez Crossing in the north and Kerem Shalom in the south. On a normal day, you would see people, merchandise, food, and supplies crossing into Gaza. But on Saturday, October 7th, Hamas launched a brutal and barbaric attack on Israel. Hamas slaughtered hundreds of Israelis, injured thousands, and abducted dozens of innocent Israelis into Gaza. Hamas bombed the crossing into Gaza and murdered the IDF soldiers stationed there. They destroyed the crossing and live streamed their rampage. So yes, those crossings between Israel and Gaza are closed. As we continue to fend off daily attacks from Hamas terrorists, we will not be giving Hamas any supplies or materials. We are at war with Hamas. This is a war they started. We have no legal obligation to supply our enemy with anything. The Israel Defense Forces has no choice. We are here to protect our families.